Family movies brief here. Today, I am going to explain a Japanese psychological thriller film called Tales of the Unusual Washing Machine. Spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. Hashimoto is a middle aged man living in Ginza, Tokyo. He is struggling financially after being laid off from his job. One morning, he goes to the laundry place to clean his clothes. After loading up the dryer, he wishes he could enjoy a can of beer. Something drops inside the dryer and makes a loud noise. On checking, he finds a can of beer inside. At first, Hashimoto believes that someone might have left it there, but he is confused when the beer turns out to be chilled. The old cleaner of the place casually tells him that the dryer fulfills everyone's wish. Hashimoto thinks he is a lunatic and ignores him, but the man walks closer and declares he is telling the truth. After he leaves, Hashimoto drinks the beer while waiting for his clothes to be cleaned. A girl enters the room and loads up her laundry. Hashimoto has never had the courage to talk to women. Because of this, he has been single his entire life. He nervously scoots to the end of the seat to make space for her. The girl sits beside him and starts a conversation. She has noticed him in the laundromat several times before and has developed a crush on him. Hashimoto, on the other hand, is oblivious of her efforts to start a conversation. He throws the now empty can to the trash bin, but it lands on the floor. When he gets up to retrieve it, Kondo starts to cry. An uncomfortable Hashimoto asks her what is wrong when she reveals that she interviewed for 40 companies but didn't get selected for any. To make her feel better, he tells her that he was also laid off from his job. He thinks that the fact she was able to interview for so many companies is amazing. This means she has the most experience in interviews than any of the candidates she meets. The girl starts to look at her situation differently after the chat. She thanks him for being nice even though she is just a stranger. Following that, he brings his clothes out and wishes her farewell. As he is leaving, the girl introduces herself as Kondo. After the encounter, Hashimoto returns home happily. At night, his mother calls him, informing him that his father has been hospitalized. They need a total of 300,000 yen to pay for the hospital bill. The responsibility falls upon Hashimoto, but he neither has a job nor savings. Yet, he promises to send them the money and visit them as soon as possible. He returns to the laundromat the very next morning. He is almost sure that the old man from yesterday was bluffing, but he still wants to test the theory. He stands in front of the dryer and asks for 300,000 yen. After waiting a few seconds, he realizes how stupid the idea is. He is about to leave when suddenly, a bundle of money appears inside the dryer. Hashimoto brings it out, still unable to believe it actually worked. The bundle has exactly the amount of money he asked for. As he tries to walk away with it, he sees the beer can from yesterday disappearing. The old man informs him that the things he receives from the dryer will disappear within a day, so he should be careful. Hashimoto thanks him and rushes outside. He happens to bump into Kondo yet again, who tells him that she got invited for a second interview for the first time in her life. Hashimoto congratulates her and gets a call from his mother yet again. Kondo hears him talk and finds out about his sick father. After chatting for a while, Hashimoto leaves to quickly send the money before it disappears. Following that, he returns to the laundromat again. He plans to use it to solve all of his problems in life. Hence, this time, he asks for a nice suit that he can wear for job interviews. He goes to interview for several companies the entire day. However, when he returns home, he gets letters from the companies informing him that he hasn't been selected for any. The suit also disappears in front of his eyes. Maybe Hashimoto should have wished for a job offer. After the failure, Hashimoto realizes now that he has an unlimited source of money, he shouldn't waste his time looking for a job. Instead, he should enjoy his life to the fullest. So, the next morning, he makes sure no one is around and wishes for a confident and beautiful girl. He adds that the girl should be envied by everyone, as beautiful as a model. One such girl steps out of the dryer, mesmerizing Hashimoto with her beauty. He walks closer and asks her to come to his house. The girl, however, slaps him in the face for being so bold on the first date. 
Hashimoto can't even get to first base with magic. She storms out of the place as Hashimoto is left stunned. After learning from his mistake, he asks for a sweet and attentive girlfriend who is pretty and loves him very much. A beautiful girl with the said qualities steps out of the dryer. The girl excitedly agrees to go out on a date with him, much to his relief. He takes her shopping and uses the money from the dryer to buy her everything she wants. It turns out that the humans created by the dryer do not have any idea of their origin and think that they are real people. At the end of the day, Hashimoto brings her back to his house. Even then, he is scared of getting too close to her, so they agree to talk the entire night. On looking at Hashimoto's palm, the girl comments that his life is very short. He is taken aback by the comment but decides to ignore it. In the morning, he finally gathers enough courage to lean in to kiss her, but she disappears right before he can. The only things left are the clothes and jewelry he bought for her. Hashimoto felt a connection with the girl, but he is not sad about the disappearance now that he can get as many girlfriends as he wants. Starting that day, he comes to the laundromat every morning and gets himself a new girlfriend, each with a different personality. He takes them on extravagant dates and buys them expensive jewelry with the money from the dryer. He is living his life to the fullest with his newfound source. One day, he is on a date with one of the girlfriends when Kondo sees him. She gets jealous and curiously follows them to a jewelry store. On seeing Hashimoto buying the girl an expensive ring, she is furious. She is also confused as to how he gained so much money in just a few days. When Hashimoto goes to the laundromat again that night, he runs into Kondo. She asks him about the money, to which he claims he won the lottery. She also finds that he is in a casual relationship with the girl she saw earlier. Kondo starts to believe that the girl is spoiling him and is using him for his money. Hashimoto is no longer the man she liked. He dismisses her concerns and walks away with another bundle of money. Following the encounter, he goes on another date to an expensive restaurant and brings his new girlfriend to the roof. He also gives her a ring and tells her that he loves her. She disappears after a few minutes, leaving only the ring behind. As usual, Hashimoto keeps the ring with him and continues about his day. Since he has been asking for innocent girls until now, he decides to go for a change and asks for someone who is seductive. A seductive girl steps out of the dryer, making him nervous. As they flirt, Kondo arrives and spies on them. She sees him giving her several rings that he has collected by now. He gets a call from his mother and asks her to keep quiet for a few seconds. When she doesn't, he has to step out of the room. Kondo takes the opportunity to talk to the girl and ask her what she has done to the old Hashimoto. When the girl laughs at her and asks her to go away, an enraged Kondo tries to snatch her rings. In the meantime, Hashimoto talks to his mother, who tells him that his father might need an operation. More than the money, the parents need him to visit them, but he has been too busy with his girlfriends to care. After the call, the old man approaches Hashimoto, saying that he has forgotten to tell him one important thing about the dryer. He says that the person who comes out of the dryer will also disappear in a day. Hashimoto laughs at him, claiming that he already knew that. Inside, the girls continue to wrestle to get the rings. In the end, the new girl leaves, thinking that Hashimoto was cheating on her. He returns to see Kondo crying and hoping that he would turn into the guy she first met a few days ago. Because of the wish, Hashimoto is teleported into the dryer. His clothes have changed into what he was wearing when he first met Kondo. He soon realizes that the dryer has granted Kondo's wish. Since he came out of the dryer, he only has a day to live. The TV shows the news about thousands of yen going missing from a jewelry shop. At the end of the movie, Hashimoto falls to the ground while Kondo watches him in confusion. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notifications, and leave a like to help the channel out. Thank you for watching.